Okay, got everything put away. Welcome back, guys. This is my grocery outlet part of my haul, and I completely forgot two bags from the 99 cent store. So I'm going to go ahead and get the 99 cent store out of the way so I can get on with the grocery outlet haul because, again, I have things that need to be put in the freezer. And kind of, I kind of like going to the discount stores first because, as you've seen, I had like Vons on there. I don't have to go to Vons now. I don't have to go to Smart and Final now because I did find better prices. So really all I'm missing for my meal plan is a couple more breakfast items. Um, my fruits, I do want to go to the farmer's market and find better melons because everywhere I went today, the melons just looked ugly and they didn't look like they were going to be sweet. So instead of wasting my money, I will be patient and wait when I find the one that comes. So went to the 99. Like I told you, I was looking for snacks. They had crap for snacks for the kids. So I got lucky, though. These are my favorite cookies. I am a type 1 diabetic. My sugar does tend to go down, though. Lately, it's been going down quite a bit. I think I'm just running myself a little too busy. Vienna Fingers, I remember my mom dipping them in her tea or in her coffee when I was little, and I absolutely love them. Um, Angie likes them. Wolf likes them. Rhiannon thinks they're gross, but I got one for me. Well, it's probably going to be... <laughs> I'm dreaming. I got two bags. They'll be eat most of them. I'll probably have a couple out of them. So, and I think these are good until... July 27th so it's pretty good also at the 99 this is what I was so excited about this is 96 fluid ounces three quarts um, of Tropicana orange juice it's 100% juice 100% vitamin C I like the fact that it is shelf stable and I do not have to have it refrigerated until I open it it is July 24th for the expiration date with seven of us drinking it It'll go pretty quick. And we drink orange juice every single day. So there was, I think, eight left, and I did pick up four. I wanted to pick up more, but to be honest with you, I didn't feel like bringing them, up, bringing them upstairs and thought it would be fair to share with other people. So I did get four of those. So I'm pretty sure that's it for the 99 this time. So I went into the grocery outlet because I always go there to kind of look for the kids' lunch snacks when the 99-cent store is slacking. Well, they were slacking too, but I did come across some lunch items and some dinner items that I thought were pretty pretty decent priced. So they had the Tyson all-natural chicken thighs cooked from frozen. It is a two and a half pound bag, and these were $1.99. I only picked up one. I like to keep some extra type of meat in the freezer in case we have company over and we want to throw more meat on the barbecue. So I picked up one of those. I picked up my usual five pound of the um ground beef and it is made by i believe it's by tyson i'm not sure but it's five pounds and it was only 8.99 and that breaks down into four meals for us so that will make hamburgers for the hamburger night lasagna and spaghetti that covers that part of my um meal plan also for breakfast the kids and the hubby like um the egg mcmuffin sandwiches I'm not spending that kind of money on McDonald's, and for some reason, McDonald's always puts my sugar up anytime I eat it. So I figure it would be healthier to make them at home. Probably not less sodium, but maybe a little bit better. You get this is a almost two pound bag, and it's four ninety nine. So even if they just eat, they and they can cook it in the microwave themselves. So if they just want to eat it with pancakes or whatnot, they can do that too. This I thought was a really really good deal. I don't know if you guys have ever tried the orange chicken from Trader Joe's. I love it, but my Trader Joe's hasn't been carrying it lately. This is Rimrock Farms. It's two sauce pouches included, and it's, see, it's a two-pound bag. Now, I was filling the chicken itself, and the chunks are about that big, so they're pretty good size. So I figured for our size family, I should pick up two. That way, even if there is leftovers, the kids will eat it for lunch, or I can put it in the hubby's lunch. So they were $3.99 each. I figure $8 for Chinese food for five people, well, seven if I have all the kids, um, is not a bad deal at all. So you just add it with the pot stickers and the spring rolls, and you have a meal. Hot dogs are big in our house. If I don't tell them they're beef, they'll never know. I love beef hot dogs. I do not like the other ones. And these were on sale for $1.99, and you get 24 count. So we do have hamburgers and links on the um, menu. I wanted to pick up some of the cheese links, but I will pick that up at 
uh, Food for Less because I still have to go to Food for Less and get the chicken that's on sale and hopefully find a watermelon there that I like. So $1.99. Then we always eat salami. We eat salami and cheese or salami sandwiches. This is the Roma Sausage Company Uncured Genoa uh, Salami. Again, it's a two pound package. It is good until September 14th. Um, along with that cheese that I got from the 99, these makes uh, good homemade Lunchables. So I picked that up. I am not in the mood of cutting lettuce this week for salads. So I just got a stay fresh bag of the uh, Fresh Express Iceberg Garden Lettuce uh, combo. This way the kids can help me put together some pre-made salads and they can just grab them and go. And this is $2.49 a bag. I also am not going to have time to make tortillas this week, so the kids like to make themselves quesadillas or they'll make peanut butter and banana burritos. They, whatever they can put together on their own, they're pretty good at making snacks. So these, for 24 of these, were $1.99, not bad. Wolf challenged his sisters to the Bean Boozled Challenge that he's seen everybody else doing. This was the only size I could find. And I figured, you know, for 49 cents, that wasn't too bad. And the fact that they're probably going to spit out the majority of them, might as well just get a small box and not be wasteful. I needed coffee creamer so bad. I was out of coffee and I was out of coffee creamer. I broke down yesterday and went to Starbucks and used the rest of my gift card to get a coffee. But I prefer making my coffee at home. And this was $1.99. And it's just, I wish it was the sugar. I thought I grabbed sugar free, but it's not. It only has five grams of sugar in it, so and I don't put a lot of creamer in my coffee, so I should be fine. When the kids are home, they also make grilled cheese sandwiches, and they don't know how to use real butter because it makes the bread rip, even though I tell them the butter is on the counter. So I just picked this up for them. I usually do not like to have margarine in the house, but this makes it for easier for them to make sandwiches. Plus, it is country crock, so it has calcium with vitamin D in it, and this was $2.00. And 49 cents, not bad at all. All right, Wolf is my sandwich child. Not only is he the serial killer, he will eat some ham and cheese sandwiches. He will come up to me and go, Ma, I need a hammy Sammy. And that's that. So he will go through this, and it'll probably take him a couple months because none of the other kids really like this cheese. But you get 72 slices, and it was $6.99. I figured that was a better price than anywhere else I've seen it. I've been kind of scoring on the cheese lately because last time I went shopping, I got the five-pound bag for, I'm going to say under $5. This time they are two-pound bags, and it was $3.25. Yes, again, it's going out of date, but I don't care because we go through it so quick anyways. So two bags of that. Along in the freezer section, they had some good deals. I found the Gourmet Dining Complete Skillet Mill with Linguini Pasta Vegetables and Alfredo Sauce with White Chicken Meat. Said it could be ready in 11 minutes, so if I wanted to tell the kids to go ahead and make dinner, it's already all in one bag. And those were only $1.49 a piece. And if we don't have them for dinner, the kids can have them for lunch, definitely. Okay, my kids love ranch. Well, all of them except for Angelina. Angelina doesn't like sauce on anything. The only thing she'll eat is barbecue sauce and ketchup. But everybody else in the house eats ranch. Now, these are two 32 fluid ounce bottles. They were $4.99. I don't think the, I think the expiration was good. That's why I got them. Yes, October 14th. So I don't know why they were such a good price. I'm not going to ask because it was a great deal. Always keep marshmallows in the house in case I want to make Rice Krispies or cereal treats. And of course, my phone is going to ring. It rings every time I do that. I'm going to ignore it. Sorry about the phone, guys. I got the Welch's Grape Jelly. Two pineapples. The pineapples were only 99 cents each. I did get a bag of the Rosa Topi or Topitos uh, potato or no to potato tortilla chips to go with the homemade salsa that we are taking to the um, potluck tonight. Corn dogs. Always keep a box of corn dogs in the house as well. Um, these were $4.99. I didn't have to go to Vaughn's because I found my favorite brand of diced tomatoes and these were 39 cents a can, so I did buy four cans. They had the Hormel cheese sauce on sale for 69 cents as well and I figured the kids could make their own nachos. Got two of those. 
Sorry about that, guys. When they can't get me on my cell phone, they call the house phone. Um, I did pick up a mega pack of the 36 bars of the Nature Valley Crunchy. You get the peanut butter and oats and honey. Like I said, kids love, love granola bars, and they're easy for us to take and go. They had the Keebler two boxes of the crackers on sale for $2.99. Figured $1.50 a box isn't bad, and the kids love those crackers over Ritz. And then they had our Founding Fathers Coffee, 100% Arabica beans. These are, uh, I think I got 100% Colombian. And they said that 50% of their profits support military or American military families. I am a military family. My nephew is in the Army, so I thought that was an awesome buy. It was $9.99, and then you get 36 cups. So I am sorry I rushed through it again and the phone ringing, but this is real, <laughs> real life. I don't feel like editing. Um, if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when we upload a video. As always, stay blessed, smile, be nice, and have a great day. And thanks for being patient with me. Bye.